guys welcome back to this channel hope everyone is fine on that note let's start this video so guys please watch the video till the end without skipping because if you skip the video you may miss some content if i make any changes in between the video so don't skip the video guys please watch full length video so please if you are new to our channel please share this with your friends and classmates and definitely like the video guys so these are completely our probable solutions if there are any changes that come to our notice definitely we will update that in the comment section later you can please give your suggestions as well let's see the first question consider a hash function h that generates hash values h1 and h2 when fed with messages m1 and m2 respectively which of the following options can never be true so for first question the probable answer is option b m1 and m2 are equal but h1 and h2 are unequal so this can never be true so mark option b next moving on to the second question now what is meant by collision in the context of hashing so for second question the probable answer is option a guys more than one different messages can generate the same hash value so mark option a next third one which of the following does not does not correspond to the first pre-image resistance in the context of hash functions so for third question the probable answer is option b next fourth question guys which of the following user are false for unkeyed hash, hash function modification detection code mdc this is the mdc so for fourth question as well the probable solution is option b guys unkeyed hash function is used to authenticate source of message so mark option b next moving on to the fifth question now so before getting into this fifth question i want to make a small announcement so that is regarding exam preparation mcqs so for the course ethical hacking we have collected the exam preparation mcqs case so these are the combination of past years mcqs nptl assignment mcqs with five years of nptl experience we have collected this so here we have we are going to provide you a huge number of 300 mcqs case 300 mcqs in a google drive pdf restricted link so in the past we have given it for 500 even for one person as well but in order to reduce burden on students we have decreased the one person price from 500 to just 300 rupees only so now a person one single student can get for 300 rupees only the 300 mcqs so the validity will be till the exam results day such option is also provided so for two to five persons you can get it combinedly for 500 rupees case so if you if anyone if your friend or classmate is doing the same course along with you then please ask them to join along with you and form a group of two to five persons and you can combinedly get that pdf for 500 rupees case if you are only one person only to worry you can get it for directly 300 rupees but if someone is uh, the someone is there along with you so, so ask them to team up with you so you can form a group and you can take combinedly for 500 rupees case. individually you can reduce less amount if you do in this way so if you are confirmed to make the payment if you are confirmed to get the pdf and make payment then mail me to this email id in order to purchase case so bk179479 at the rate gmail.com 
so this is the mail id if you have to mail me if you are confirmed to make the payment if, and if you want the pdf so already many students professors and associate professors as well that taking the package so everyone have started already started preparing for this course so take it now itself guys so that you can get more time to prepare and more time to revise at the end so this is the mail id so this is the mail id guys so i'll give the same email id in, ID in the description box as well so 300 mcqs guys no one is providing no other channel is doing this only our channel is providing 300 mcqs for one person 300 rupees only for two to five persons combinedly 500 rupees only guys so that's it guys now let's get back to the solutions so fifth question which of the following statements is or are true so for fifth question the probable answer is so actually there are So for fifth question, I have got two probable solutions. The first one is option B. Encryption realizes a one-to-one -one mapping. And the other one is option C. Hashing realizes a one many-to-one -one mapping. So these two are the probable solutions for fifth question. So mark option B and C. Next, sixth question. So uh, next one, the sixth question, which of the following are hash functions? So for sixth question, once again, there are two probable solutions guys that I have got. The first one is option A, that is MD5 and the other one is option C guys, SHA1. So mark option A and option C. Next, seventh one. Hash functions are slower as compared to symmetric and public key encryption. So, for this seventh question, the probable solution is option B. False. Next, eighth question, guys. What are the block size and key size of the DES algorithm? So for 8th question, the probable answer is option A guys. So block size is 64 bits and key size is 56 bits. So mark option A. Next, moving on to the ninth question. Which of the following is or are true for digital signature? So for ninth question, once again, there are two probable solutions that I have got. The first one is option A and the other one is option C guys. So mark option A and option C as the probable solutions for ninth question. And moving on to the final question of the assignment. So before getting into this final question, I want to once again make you remember guys, for the course Ethical Hacking, we have collected the exam preparation MCQs with 5 years of NPTEL experience. Here you are going to get a huge number of 300 MCQs guys. 300 MCQs in a Google Drive PDF restricted link. So for one person, it is 300 rupees only. If you take it combinedly, so if your classmates or friends is doing the same course along with you then ask them to team up with you so that you can form a two to five persons group and share it for just 500 rupees only so already many students and professors also taking this package so take it now itself so if you're confirmed to make the payment and want to get the pdf then definitely mail me to this email id guys bk179417 at the rate gmail.com so i'll give the same email id in the description box as well so take it now itself guys so that you can get more time to revise at the end so please share this news with your friends and classmates in your unofficial WhatsApp college student groups. So make some discussion happen on this so that you can get 
some support you can get uh, your friends approval as well so that you can team up as a group guys and you can take this pack in order to reduce the individual price right so that's it guys now let's see the last solution so 10th one the SSL record protocol is responsible for so for 10th and final question the probable answer is option B is data authentication so mark option B as the probable solution so friends these are the solutions for week 7 assignment of ethical hacking course so hope this video helpful for you if you feel the same please subscribe our channel like this video and definitely share this news with your friends and classmates guys and keep supporting us like this so definitely like the video and please if you are confirmed to make the payment of, for 300 mcqs and if you want this pdf you can mail me to this email id guys so don't forget to purchase this pack it will really really helpful for you in the preparation for the final exam so that's it guys for this video so keep supporting us like this so until the next video goodbye thank you